Hi everyone! I'm so excited to talk about what we're going to learn today, but first, let's say our verse together. Ready? Call to me, and I will answer you, and I will tell you great and mighty things which you do not know. Jeremiah 33.3 Way to go! I want you to practice it again, but this time, I want you to say it in your favorite silly voice. You could use your or your cowboy voice. You could use your robot voice or even a deep giant voice. Look around the room for your grown-up and when you find them, point and say, you're my grown-up. Grown-ups, when the verse comes on the screen, pause the video and practice together. Everyone ready? Go! Great job! That verse is from God's Word, the Bible. And what do we know about the Bible? It's absolutely true! Absolutely true! Everything the Bible says is absolutely true! That's right! Today, we're going to talk about how we are made in the image of God. And we are going to learn that God is our Creator. Do you know what Genesis 1-1 says? It says, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. That means God made the sun, the moon, and the stars. He made the oceans and the rivers. God made the flowers and the trees, the rhinos, the fish, the sharks. God made everything. And God said that everything he made was good. Then God created human beings, and he made them extra special. The Bible tells us that when God made man and woman, he made them in his own image. That means that when he created them, they were different from the plants and the animals. God gave them a brain that could think and a heart that could feel. Do you remember the first two humans God created? Adam and Eve, that's right. And guess what? God made you too. Psalm 139 tells us that God knit us together before we were even born. That means God chose your nose and your smile, your fingers and your eyes. God decided whether you would be a boy or a girl. God chose the sound of your voice and the color of your hair. God decided how tall you would be, and He even created your belly button. God made you exactly the way He wanted you to be, and God loves you because you are His creation. God created your body, and He also made you good at things. Are you a really good dancer or a problem solver? Maybe a super fast runner or a creative artist? or maybe even a really funny joke teller? God made you that way. God created some of us to love the mountains while others of us prefer the beach. And God gave some of us a sweet tooth while other people like salty treats. All of us are different, but all of us are created by God. I think this is a great time for a question. Grownups, when you see it on the screen, pause the video until you're ready to move on. Friends, God is our creator. He made you just the way he wanted you to be, and he loves you. When this video ends, pray and thank God for creating you in his image. Thanks for joining us. See you next time.